everybody, welcome back to my channel. In today's video, I want to talk about some more classic color combinations. In the past, when I've done these videos, I've focused on a couple colors throughout the video and different combos that I particularly like. But in today's video and moving forward, I'm going to focus just on one color at a time and really break down a lot of combinations with that particular color that I really love and think look fantastic. My hope is that by doing that, you can really focus in on some colors that might be perfect for your personal color palette and serve as really great accent or base colors so that you can get some inspiration and then feel confident adding those to your wardrobe to really enhance your style. So we are going to start off with the color green because I really love green and I'm seeing it everywhere right now. So it's a really good opportunity to start adding it to your closet because it's easily accessible. So let's get started. I thought a good place to start these videos would be to focus on a little bit of the color psychology behind the color we're going to be spotlighting. So when it comes to green, I think it's really fascinating because like most of these, when you start to really break down kind of what they mean to us and how they make us feel, it's almost always spot on and green in particular is exactly that for me. So for most instances, green represents growth and harmony and I think that that's exactly the feeling that I get when I wear it and when I look at it. I feel very, very balanced, very calm, and not too far one way or another. And I think that that brings something so nice to my not only personal style, but also how it makes me feel. And especially right now, I think that's something we can all benefit from. And really quickly, green also represents growth and hope. And I think that is exactly how I feel when I look at the color. For me personally, when I think of green, I think of spring, which is my favorite season. And I love it because everything blooms. We get a lot of beautiful flowers and trees and grass. And it makes me feel of all of the hope that comes with the new season and then all of the great seasons that come after spring. So I really love it. And I think that when you break down the color psychology behind a color and it affirms how it makes you feel, it's so interesting and something really helpful to consider for why you might want to be wearing that color during a particular season of your life or maybe just to lift your mood or mellow your mood. So it can be used to your advantage to really enhance your style, not only from a fashion fashion standpoint, but also how it makes you feel. And when I put on an outfit and it makes me feel good, that is so much more important than how I think I look when I look at myself in the mirror. So combining those two is really the end goal for me. So hopefully through this series, you can find some of that for yourself as well. Now let's talk about some of my favorite colors to pair with the color green. These are some of my personal favorite combinations because I think they always look fantastic. You can of course cater them to your personal preferences. You can make them warmer or cooler to suit your coloring and what you like to wear. And I also think that these can be worn all the time. They don't feel really season specific at all, and you can change them up with accessories. And then also, I think they're super timeless and really classic. They don't feel tied to any particular trend or any decade. So I think you can pair them with confidence in your closet forever and not feel like you're compromising your personal style because you're finding a combination that you can come back to year after year, which I really love because finding Finding something that's a cornerstone to what makes you feel really great, I think is the real key to style. So the first combination that I want to talk about is green and white or green and off-white, whatever your preference is. And I really love this because like I mentioned earlier, green can feel super fresh and signify a new season and new flowers and everything and new trees. So pairing it with something really bright like a white automatically feels really balanced to me. I think they go so well together. It's a combination that I really love because you can play with accessories on top of it and it feels super subtle, but also really, really dynamic. It's not your basic white and navy or white and black. It's a little bit softer, but still has that vibrancy that I really love. Another color that I really love to pair with green is black, and that's because black is a key color for my personal color palette. It's one of my main base colors, and I have a lot of black in my wardrobe. As you can see, I'm wearing black today, and that's because my hair is basically black, and I've got really high contrast in my coloring, especially when I'm less tan, and so I 
I find that it plays beautifully with my overall coloring and then with the accent colors that I choose to add. So making sure that they look good with black is really important when building my color palette. So with green, what I really love is that when I pair it with black, it gives a totally different message than when I pair it with white. When I pair it with white, it feels really fresh and really vibrant and really versatile. But when I pair it with black, it feels a little bit more serious, a little bit more anchored, and I think gives a beautiful variation in deeper tones. So as you know, I love to pair black with navy and blue because I get that similar effect. And when I do it with green, I get the really strong color of the black with the calm feeling that I get from the green. So they play really well together in my opinion. And I think you can't go wrong. Any accent color paired with your favorite base color is definitely the way to go. I also really love how green looks with blue and that means any shade of blue. So I love it with navy, obviously, that's one of my base colors. So I really consider that when choosing an accent color. But then I also love how it looks with lighter blues and every variation within that spectrum. I think they all look so beautiful together. And as you know, my recommendation for choosing colors is to try to find things that are either all cool or all warm, but you can absolutely pair warm with cool colors and I think that when you're doing something like a green and a blue they're so close to each other that you can have a little bit more leeway and really really have fun with your personal style like I mentioned earlier one of my favorite ways to wear color or any of the more vibrant accent colors in my closet is to pair them with neutrals so I recommend having your color palette consist of mostly neutral colors and then accent that with more vibrant accent colors. So your neutral base colors should be colors that make you feel really, really confident every time you wear them. Things like black, navy, gray is beautiful for this, taupe even, camel, and then accent that with colors that just make you feel really vibrant and awake and speak to different seasons and different trends. So for me personally, I spent a really long time building out my color palette and for years it was pretty locked and pretty, pretty basic. And I did that because I wanted to be sure that I really liked my color palette before I just started adding things because as you know, my entire entire objective behind my wardrobe curation is slow and steady to be as thoughtful as I can be and to really make sure I'm spending time figuring out what I love so I don't waste clothes. I don't buy things and then don't wear them and then contribute to the growing waste that we have when it comes to wardrobes. So for me, I spent a lot of time with a really neutral, really basic color palette. But now that I know how much I love green, I'm adding more. And one of my favorite ways to pair green with my existing color palette is to wear it with camel. I think that camel is a color that goes with everything. And for me and my coloring, it's a color that can be kind of hard to wear. So everyone always says you need a camel coat, you need a camel or beige, everything kind of. And that never really worked totally for me because my skin is basically the color of camel or beige. So in order to make it work without feeling drawn or drained and looking tired, even though I didn't feel tired, I would pair it with colors that make me feel automatically vibrant. So things like navy or black and then also green. And I think that by pairing camel with any of those accent colors, you give it a really beautiful anchor. And then of course, because camel is so neutral, you can add a couple accent colors and then really round out your wardrobe in a beautiful way. So I really love camel, green, and white. I think pairing those three together gives such harmony to the palette and it's just a really, really classic combination that never misses. And then of course, I had to include green with other shades of green. So maybe that's the same color of green from head to toe or a lighter green with a darker green and just every combination within that. I think anytime you pair similar colors together, you get a really, really beautiful look. And I think green in particular, because it is so calming and feels so sophisticated, is a really great color to play around with in this head to toe look. I think you can't go wrong. And I I think it's something that really shows that you know your personal style. Anytime you can find a color that isn't a kind of standard neutral color, so that isn't black, it isn't gray, it isn't camel, it isn't navy, and you wear that shade from head to toe, 
you make a real big statement and I think do so in such an elegant way that really shows that you know who you are and that you know your personal style. So this is one that I'm really getting into and I'm slowly working up my green in my wardrobe so that I can replicate a head to toe green look and just feel really, really put together and super, super vibrant. So I can't wait for that. And there's so much inspiration on Pinterest full of this. So I will link some really great inspiration down below for you to take a peek. And last but not least is green paired with kind of any other accent color. I think that since green is such a balanced, harmonious color and you can find something really deep or kind of more muted to suit your preferences, you can really treat it as a base color in certain instances. So the first combination in this subcategory that I always think of is green and pink. It's a really classic preppy color combination and I think it's one that especially when the green is richer and the pink is a little bit softer always looks fantastic and I think will continue to look fantastic for years and years and then of course green and yellow looks really great it makes a really bold statement and something that can really accent your personal style and speak to your personality and then also green and orange if you are bold enough to pair those two together I guarantee you your outfit will be unforgettable and if that's a combination that makes you feel fantastic that can be something that becomes part of your personal style that you really won't see everywhere, which I of course love. And then also green and red. I know that we think of that as being really holiday and very Christmas, but I think that especially when you anchor it with something like a navy and maybe you wear a tweed or a green pattern that has some blue in it, you can make it feel a little bit less Christmas and just more holiday or fall and winter. And I think it looks fantastic. And then of course you can kind of mute both of them out so maybe choose a green that isn't so bright and not as pine green color, maybe a little bit softer, maybe even like an olive green, and then pair that with either a really rich red or a softer red. And I think by doing that, you send a different message. It doesn't read as Christmas anymore and instead just reads as a really, really complimentary color combination that I encourage you to find for yourself. So I hope that you liked this. And if you like green as much as I do, I hope you're enjoying this moment where we can finally find the color because it's been so hard to find for a while and outside of vintage pieces I haven't had much luck and I remember like probably eight years ago when I first started kind of really focusing on my personal style I had this shirt that was a really beautiful rich green color and it was polyester it was inexpensive it did not last very long and I haven't been able to find something like that since so now that I'm finding the color popping up everywhere I'm taking full advantage and really having fun making that a part of my personal color palette so if you like green i hope you are as well and definitely let me know in the comments down below the other colors you want in this series i've got a few coming up but i would love to hear what you're interested in and i will add those to my list and like always thank you so much for watching and i'll see you in my next one have a great day